Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scopes. Today we have the Air Max 90 Gore Tex, and that's in Photon Photon Dust Summit White, and the Air Max 90 Gore Tex, and that is in Black Tor Yellow Cargo Khaki. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like, leave your thoughts, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah yeah, purchase links for both pairs in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot and the waterproof test. So yeah, let's start from the soles up. So we have a black and pink outsole. We have a black midsole, midsole wedge, pink air unit. And then we come to this upper. So this upper is composed of smooth grain leather. It is of a decent quality. And if we go from around the toe, you'll see that we've got gray on the mud guard. We have an olive on the upper and the toe box is more of a tumbled leather and that is in black. Very, very nice. Going up the shoe, you'll see that we have a gray leather euphro matching the mud guard and we have the eyelets set in these plastic portions right here. Those are black as well, very, very nice. The laces, black laces to the thickness that I like, and these conceal a black ripstop tongue. At the top of the tongue, we have the Gore-Tex logo, very, very nice, and that's stitched in in gray. The reverse of the tongue is in that tour yellow, very nice. If we go to the mid portion of the shoe, you'll see that we have a tall yellow swoosh that sits above a gray mudguard and sits on an olive leather upper. Very, very nice. And the little window here features Gore-Tex rather than Air Max, and that's in pink with the Gore-Tex written in that tall yellow. The collar of the shoe is black ripstop, similar to the tongue. And then at the heel of the shoe, you'll see that we have tour yellow for the Nike and swoosh, pink for the air on a black heart. The whole affair is in black with a gray mudguard base. Taking a look inside the shoe, you'll see that we have a black sock liner with a black and white Gore-Tex portion, that liner right there, very, very nice. And then for the insole, we have a black Nike Air sitting on that pink insole. Let me know your thoughts on this pair. Very, very nice. Let's take a look at the Photon Dust Summit White pair. Starting from the soles up, we have a black outsole with that chlorophyll green color. Very, very nice. We have a white midsole, Photon Dust wedge and chlorophyll air unit. And then we come to this upper. So the upper is composed of, again, quite smooth grain leather. And we have two shades of gray right here. We have a lighter shade on the mud guard. We have a slightly darker shade on the upper. And then for the toe, we have white leather. This white leather, I think my pair is defective. As you can see, we have a smooth grain and we have a tumbled. So I think it's supposed to be both tumbled. I'm not sure what's going on here but it is what it is. As we go up the shoe, you'll see that the euphro is in that gray leather and we have the plastic portions in white for the eye stays, for the laces, very, very nice. And you'll see that these laces are in that very, very light gray. Again, to the thickness that I like. These conceal a very light gray tongue, which is in ripstop. And then at the top of this tongue, you'll see that we have the black Gore-Tex logo, which is embroidered. If we go to the mid portion of the shoe, you'll see that we have a white smooth grain leather swoosh sitting on a gray upper leather construction against a gray mud guard. Very, very nice. You'll see that the window right here features the Gore-Tex in black sitting in a tonal gray um, plastic portion. And then at the top right here, this panel is in white ripstop for the collar. Very, very nice. Then going to the heel of the shoe, you'll see that we have a black Nike Air on a gray heart. Underneath, we have that chlorophyll green for the air. Very, very nice. Taking a look inside the shoe now, you'll see that we have a gray sock liner and the base of that sock liner features that Gore-Tex material. Very, very nice. That's in green and white. 
and we have the insole also in that chlorophyll green with the black Nike Air. Let me know what you think of this pair. For me, with both pairs, I like both pairs. The colours are pretty good on both of them. I think I edge towards the white pair over this um, black and green one, but I do like both the elements on them. The white pair just looks like that kind of winter woods kind of effect. I do like it. Um, nice winter forest. I do like this one. And the elements of green, so subtle, so small, but they really do shine on this one. I like the accents of yellow and pink on this pair, on the black one. Um, I think they're really good. The olive, it works because of the pink. It really does work. So I'm not too mad at it. It's not really my go-to, but it just works. Obviously, as this is a Gore-Tex pair, you'll get the nice little hand tag right here. So pause, read the literature here. Obviously boasting those Gore-Tex properties and made to keep your feet dry. So let's put that to the test. Well, as you can see that these have passed the test, the waterproof test, just done a little bit of water and tested it. The tissue paper came out all right. So all in all, very, very good. I didn't need to test the black pair. It's the same shoe. So it's just the colorway, which is different, not the materials. The Air Max 90 Gore-Tex. I give these a 7.5 out of 10 each for both pair. Very, very nice. I do prefer the white and gray pair over this one very, very slightly, but I am happy with both of them. One thing to note, the materials on these do not compare to the undercover Air Force One Gore-Tex collaboration. I've done a review of those, so check that out. The level on those are much better than these, if in case you were wondering. Check out that review as well another waterproof pair. Anyway, I've been Scopes. Thank you so much for sharing, watching, subscribing, leaving your thoughts. It is always appreciated. Also, big up Static for requesting the review of these. Your support and your comment and everything is greatly, greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. Remember, purchase links for both in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot. I've been Scopes, signing out. See ya!